Howdy folks, and welcome to Yucatan Anglers TV. Today, we're not fishing. I am fixing to meet up with Maria Jose and Manuel Rosado from Progresso Tourism. And we are gonna take a look at the, the dog shelter here in Progresso. Why? Because we are going to raise over 100,000 pesos to remake, makeover, rejuvenate, the dog shelter here in Progresso that is duly needed to make a nice, comfortable, beautiful setting for the uh, for the dogs that are, are collected. So folks, I hope you can join me in raising money through this amazing raffle. We have over 30 prizes with over 40,000 pesos in value that we're gonna give away. We have 200 tickets available valued at 500 pesos each on my post on Facebook on Randy Bowser Yucatan Snook you can see all of the details and I really do hope you guys can join me in, in creating a beautiful setting for the animals of Progresso we've done it for Chilem and Chuberna we need to do it here for Progresso so y'all stay tuned I hope you like this Howdy folks and welcome to Yucatan Anglers TV. As you can see, we're not fishing today, but we are here at the Ecological Animal, what do we call this? It's the Animal Veterinary. Veterinarian Services. Animals that have been hit by a car or have issues um, that need to be spay and neutered that have been collected. They come here and then Dr. Monica, of all people, from our uh, Paws on the Beach in Chilem, comes over and helps with the spay and neutering of our animals. I am with Maria Jose and Manuel Rosado, my two good friends from Progresso Tourism. And I'm telling you, every time I ask for something to get done, these guys here, they jump on and they get it done for us. Maria, do you wanna say a few words? Well, we got some something special coming up and hopefully everybody can join in and help out. Yeah, I hope everybody can help. Um, we have a lot of animals here that need the, need the, this infrastructure to, to be improved. So it will be great to have uh, support from the community. And you know, the community and business leaders have stepped up and donated well over 40,000 pesos for the prizes. We have over 30 amazing prizes that we're gonna be giving away in our raffle. That starts this coming Tuesday, the 20th. 500 pesos a ticket, only 200 tickets available. So buy as many as you can, help out the shelter, help out these animals, and we'll see you here real soon. So, folks, hi, it's me again, but I'm gonna cover up because we're in, in the public, but what makes me really, really excited is that Dr. Monica from Paws on the Beach in Chilem is over here all the time, spaying and neutering these animals. Dr. Monica said to me that what we don't wanna create here is a shelter where people can come and drop their dogs or cats off. This is not what this is gonna be. This is going to be for rehabilitation, for spay and neutering of the animals of Progresso. No? Yes, it's what we can do here. And Dr. Monica has explained to me what needs to be done with the cages, with the plumbing, with the cistern that we're going to tear out and clean out and make bigger and acceptable because when they wash, all of the urine and so forth, water comes back up and it's just not sanitary. And we want to make this, well, we want to make this a beautiful space for the animals that are recovering. How come it doesn't have 
Hello, baby. So Dr. Monica and Lisa, this is their work area here in Progresso for spay and neutering of the animals. Monica, you want to explain a little more? Sure. Well, we decided when we come here it was basics, you know, walls and things like that. We've been trying to do it a little more work workable for sure. the spay and neuter. And this is the tables we are using now and some spaces when we try to keep clean this area for do the spay and neuter for. But some of the issues here is you don't really have all the time the materials that are needed to spay and neuter. No. Is that correct? No, no. Which is one of the things that we want to do with the funds that are raised to make sure those materials are here, or at least with you, so that you can bring them here to carry out the needs that are sure. here. Sure, and yes, those sir. materials that I put with you, with the money, are designated for here. Yeah, the idea is, you know, the situation in Progreso was very bad a year ago, so I, I come back here and work with the team and try to do better. Actually, we go to other areas on Progreso. Yes, yes, We I not only stay here, you know, we go to all the municipal areas and we try to work because the situation is for, for all, no? for the situation. Yes. So yes, it's, it's always a, a big gap in a good material sometimes because it's expensive, you know, run sure, a no, program course, like this, it's, it's really, it's a really gigantic effort. So these are babies who were rescued from Boyanes. The people in the area don't want them. And we are trying to catch the mama. They are eight and they got to be in urine and we got try to use that area for put them until we found homes for them. Excellent. Excellent.